it's time to check in on the animals at the new zoo in Swamico. Neil Anderson joins us live this morning from Swamico. Good morning, Neil. How are you? Hey, well, very good. Waking up here, nice, clear, and cold morning, and everybody's waking up on the North American plains. You know, and we talked to, oh, a few months ago of uh, one of our new arrivals was a little pronghorn. And, you know, the pronghorn, initially when it came in, he came in from the Minnesota Zoo. He's actually owned uh, by uh, Montana Fish and Wildlife, and he's going to join the prong pronghorn out here on exhibit. Now, one of the things we did is we bring him in initially into the animal hospital area, and that's uh, for a period of quarantine. So at that period of time, we take about 30 days to check, make sure his health is, is good. And then, at, then after that, we moved him down behind. Remember, he was down behind the giraffe exhibit. Well, during that time, what we did is we constructed a new fenced-in area, which is really going to help us out, not only manage this little guy, uh, you can see Sherman over here, uh, to go ahead and manage him to go ahead and have a successful um, entrance and introduction into the North American Plains, but also will give us a, another tool to go ahead and manage the pronghorn out here. Now you can see this area is adjacent to the uh, North American Plains. You can see the bison in the background. So what we did is we had this open area, it's kind of right below our giraffe stand as well, and we did, decided to fence this area in. We do have one side of the barn that we have available as well. But I want you to take a look at this gate over here. And this is something that we did which is going to really be nice for us. As you can see, we put a gate in to go into the exhibit. We have some rocks there. We kind of move those around so that only the pronghorn can get into this area. Mm. And then you can also see with the gate, you know, we've got a half gate. So it's nice and low so we can open up that lower. What that'll do is we'll have an area for Sherman to go when he goes out into the exhibit. If he wants to get away, you know, from the elk and the bison out there, he can come back in. Also, the pronghorn can come in here. And what it does, too, is it gives us an area that we can then start to, as you can see, his feed dish is over here. But what we'll do is we'll feed the pronghorn then in those areas so that they can come in and then we have a nice area that if in fact down the road then we have to look at vaccinations, uh, do any work on our pronghorn, we've got kind of a nice catch pen as well. So it's really working out nice. The big thing too is gives him an opportunity to get nose to nose with the pronghorn and everybody else. I can tell you as soon as we moved him down here, <laughs> right away the bison were over here checking him out, nose to nose, making sure that uh, they know who's going to be next to the exhibit and eventually in the exhibit. So it's really going to work out nice for an introduction area and a nice tool for us to have for the future as well. Yeah, it sounds like it. New neighbors. Exactly. Mm -hmm. new, <laughs> absolutely. New neighbors. You know, and the drafts are right here. They get a chance to take a look at them as well. But it really is a, it is a nice tool that we were hoping to go ahead and have, and it's going to give us, a, a, like say, a lot of potential for managing pronghorn out on this exhibit uh, as uh, the future you know unfolds as well. Yeah. So the plural of pronghorn is pronghorn? It is pronghorn. Okay. Yes. Now we know. Now right. we know. We had a debate on that yesterday. So. <laughs> well, we'll check. Oh. We'll check back with hey, the next who, hour. Who was right? I was wrong. Who was right? I was oh. wrong. Oh. What did you say? I hate to admit it. <laughs> I was wrong. Wow. That's just that's <sighs> too bad. That's well, It'll never happen again, though. Neil, <laughs> <laughs> we'll check Neil. back with you next hour. All right. Hey, sounds good.